excuse? Brother, I can't make amal on deen, I can't practice deen because I'm not living in Makkah. But take this out of your brain. I can't make amal, I can't practice upon deen because I'm not living in Al Jazair, I'm not living in Tunisia, I'm not living in Morocco, I'm not living in Pakistan. That's why. Why have you destroyed yourself? Why have you thrown yourself into the darkness? Why have you thrown yourself into the, into the ditches? Because you have left and forsaken your deen. Don't blame the country, blame your own actions. Alhamdulillah, thumma alhamdulillah, and I say this without any hesitation, that we in this country enjoy the right of religious practice and religious freedom. Right or wrong? And therefore to use this excuse is frivolous, is, is joke, is empty, baseless, fuzul. That if I was in my own country, what do you mean own country? So that means it will just automatically sort out because you are there. But it fits up to a new era. You are now in this country and so are your children. So use this as an excuse, does not work in the court of Allah, forget let alone working in the court of someone like myself or yourself. We, if we develop the quality of taqwa, which was the maqsad and purpose of Ramadan, would find there would be a change within our lives. That is why Allah Ta'ala made us fast. Do you think Allah Ta'ala made us fast for fun? Just to see what would happen if I make them have to go without food or water? To see what would happen if I tell them they can't go and fulfill necessities from the wife, in, obviously for a restricted, restricted period of time? You have to worship of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala throughout different parts of the day. You have to abstain from certain things, fulfill certain things, so on and so forth. What, you think Allah gets anything out of it? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is qawi from before until now. Allah is aziz from before until now. Allah is akbar before until now. And until the day of qiyamah, Allah's greatness will always increase, it will never decrease. Allah doesn't get anything out of the ata'at of you and I. Rather, this was the shafqat, the rahmat, and the mehrbani and favor of Allah upon us. He knew what was best for us. He put this upon us just so we can develop ourselves. And you saw it and we all saw it. What was the mahal? What was the environment like when in the month of Ramadan? Good or bad, right or wrong, subhanahu Allah, no one will say that it was a negative, it was always a positive. Hegany. This was the reality. More people coming to the masjid, more people praying salah, more people reading the Quran, <coughs> more people taking part in Durus, more people taking part in Dhikrullah, more people taking part in Silatul Rahim, joining the family ties. Even Subhanallah giving food to the neighbors and relatives and Muslims living nearby, even they benefited as well. محمد رسول الله عليه صلاة الله وآله والأحبة لا إله إلا الله محمد رسول الله عليه صلاة الله وآله